Wow, <laughs> a party! What are you celebrating? Huh? What? Hi. Hope I'm not too late. And here we have the guest of honor. Meet Eva. You dreamed of having a sister, so we decided to adopt her. <laughs> what? Wow! Don't you see? She's a vampire! You don't have to try. They won't hear you. You're finished! Now come here! <laughs> you won't catch me, idiot. What the heck? I can't be hypnotized. Don't even try. This is the first time I've met someone who can't be hypnotized. How do you do this? Oh well. Now she'll obey me. <laughs> oh, go away! I'll show my parents what you're like! Come on, take the garlic! <laughs> Try and catch me! Gosh, I need to kick her out of here! Mom? Dad, can you hear me? Oh no. Now I'll show her. Wow. There's a vampire in my house. My house. Ugh. How could this happen? Casey, darling, what happened? You sounded upset on the phone. Imagine. My parents adopted a daughter. <laughs> That's wonderful. Now you have a sister. Wonderful, my foot. Do you know who she is? She's a vampire, Chris! A vampire! Ow, my head hurts. Why are you yelling? I want everyone to know what she is. Chris, are you okay? I'm okay, Casey. I think I'm sick. What's with your sister? She's a vampire? Yes, imagine. You and I have been looking for vampires for several years, hunting them like idiots, and this Eva just came into my house. Wow. I've been saying for a long time that our town is in danger. We need to catch all the vampires and save the city. Ow! <sighs> I think I need to rest. Chris, thank you. You're my favorite. We'll catch this, Eva. Did we make a plan to catch vampires for so many years in vain? Time to get down to business. Yes! We won't let vampires walk around like they own the place. I remind you, tomorrow is my birthday. So I want you to throw the best celebration in the world for me. Of course, sweetheart. We will give you whatever you want. Wonderful. I need a golden coffin to sleep in. That's enough. Why are you torturing them? They haven't done anything. Oh, you! Oops, our Casey isn't happy. Tomorrow is my birthday. Don't you ruin it. Are you crazy? What birthday? First, unhypnotize my family. Why should I? They give me whatever I want like this. Huh? Go away and don't bother me. Cassie, don't yell at Eva. Casey, don't upset your sister. That's it. I'm sick of it. Take this. <coughs> Mom, Dad, look. She's scared of the sun. I don't understand what you're talking about. Oh, stop it. I'm sick of it. What is the problem? Why doesn't hypnosis work on you? <laughs> Serves you right. I'll show our parents a picture of your red eyes, and they'll kick you out. Just try. They'll never come to their senses. <laughs> and I'll deal with you. Did you see? She turned into a bat! Who? Cassie, is everything alright? Well, I'll show her. 
time to give her a couple birthday presents. Casey is so strange. I agree. We should take her to the doctor. This is humiliating. Am I really a hunter if a vampire moved into my house? You're the best. Chris, hi. Hi, how are you? My head hurts again. I'm fine. I'm giving my sister a birthday present. A garlic necklace. <laughs> awesome. Amazing idea. How was your day? Did you manage to expose Eva? <coughs> yes, but my parents didn't react. She hypnotized them and they can't understand. But it's fine. Tomorrow I'll give this to her and she'll give up herself right away. Give her silver instead. <coughs> Gosh, I'm so sick. <coughs> Don't come too close. I'm contagious. <coughs> Chris! Are you okay? You look really sick. I'm better now. Don't worry. I was just out in the rain and I probably caught a cold. But your love heals me. You're so brave. But every girl has her vampire hunter. Chris, you're my favorite ever. Please don't be sick. I'm so glad you're a vampire hunter too. Just imagine my friend's dream of a vampire boyfriend. <laughs> How awful. <laughs> Please feel better. Hooray! My birthday! <sighs> I stopped counting after a hundred years. <laughs> Today will be the best day and no one will ruin it for me. I need to sparkle today. I need to get my fangs in order. <sighs> I'm so pretty. And that weakling Casey will never destroy me. <gasps> Ow! Darn! <sighs> Fine. A new one will grow in. I am a vampire. <laughs> <laughs> That's it. I can go accept the celebrations. <laughs> Surprise! <sighs> thank you. Thank you, parents. Thank me too, birthday girl. <laughs> That's better. Hey, does that bother you? What is she talking about? Casey, stop ruining your sister's mood. Blow out the candles! I want my parents to obey me completely. Oops, I forgot. And that she'll obey me too. <laughs> You're such a jerk. Stop pushing our parents around. Uh-huh. What will you do to me? I advise you to make friends with me because I'm the boss here and what I say happens. Oh, fine. <laughs> I'm sorry. And I really was wrong. Let's make friends. Finally, you made friends, girls. Isn't this a nice day, darling? Yes, honey. Our girls are so lovely. Hmm, I somehow don't believe that you suddenly decided to make friends with me. I'm not lying. Here, I even made a present for you. Open it. A present? For me? How oh, cool! I thought you hated me! Ah! What have you done? Casey! Did you hurt Eva? Eva, where does it hurt? Cassie, how could you? It's your sister's birthday! Aren't you ashamed? She's a vampire! Silver hurts her! This is nonsense! Now go to your room! Don't ruin Eva's day! Come on! I'll still show you that I'm right! I'm tired of your Eva! I'll get revenge on you, Casey! No one ruins a vampire's birthday! Ugh, it smells like garlic in here! The important thing is not to look anywhere and not touch anything! I'll enchant her mirror and teach her to make fun of me. I, huh, I can take care of this hunter. There. Shh, 
She'll earn her place. I want to go shopping. First, drink milk. It is very healthy. And you aren't eating anything. Yeah, your dad's right. You're so skinny. Drink. Drink. What garbage! Okay, give me money. I really want new clothes. Sorry, but we can't give you money right now. We spent a lot of money on presents. And we have Casey. And we need to buy her something. Hey, now you'll learn a lesson. So, will you give me money? Yes, Eva. Of course. Take this. Don't deny yourself anything, sweetheart. Oh, I love you. <laughs> uh <laughs> You're so stupid. <sighs> Finally, I can drink something nice. Not this nonsense. Bye, parents. Ah, uh, she's so wonderful. I don't know what to do with this Eva anymore. I'm sick of her. And my parents are obsessed with her. They forgot about me. Calm down. Everything will be okay. You'll catch her. By the way, I cleaned the bathroom and found her fang. Perfect. Show it to your parents. This is a serious piece of evidence. But how can I break the spell so that she stops hypnotizing mom and dad? Mm, take a clove of garlic and fling it at her. I read that if you shoot garlic in a slingshot, it's more effective. Ah! Chris, why aren't we reflected in the mirror? I don't know. Casey, how is this possible? Chris, have we become vampires? But how? That's impossible. Unless... Eva bit us! Ah! Ah! Oh no! Why didn't we notice? We need to see if we have bite marks on our necks. You don't have anything there. You don't either. Strange. We're not vampires. We'd feel it. She's done something to the mirror. That's right. Getting revenge on her birthday. Well, I'll teach her a lesson. She'll never be able to hypnotize people after this. Exactly. So be it. Alright. I'm going to buy myself a new leather skirt. <laughs> Caught you. You won't get away from me. <laughs> Just try and attack me again. I'll still get you. <sighs> well, do you like how I enchanted the mirror in your room? Yes, I even believed it for a second. But I'm not as stupid as you think. I'll catch you. I have a bunch of other anti-vampire stuff. <sighs> oh no, how scary. You think you can frighten a vampire? I'm much stronger than you. And I possess magic that you, little schoolgirl, can't imagine. I even slow down time. <laughs> How silly! You couldn't even think of anything more original. That's it. You're definitely going to listen to me. Did you forget? Hypnosis doesn't work against me. Don't even try. That's impossible! How are you doing this? I'm a vampire hunter. After all these years and you don't think I'd make an anti-hypnosis medallion? It's the only one in the whole world. <laughs> You're so stupid, Eva. I'll show you, Casey. This isn't the end. I'm so sick of Casey. She's a real freak. Anything more and I'll need to get her out of this house. Hi, my name is Dylan. Do you mind if I sit here? I'm not looking for a friend. Cool lenses. Why do you think I want to make friends? <laughs> can you read my thoughts? <laughs> yes, I can. What do you want from me? You're so funny. And you love tomato juice too, just like me. <laughs> if you can read thoughts, show me. What are those people thinking about? 
Go, tell me for all of them. How to make money. Need to feed the cat. Don't forget to hit like on this video. <laughs> what about me? What am I thinking about? And now you're my prey. You'll be my boyfriend. <laughs> <gasps> my love, I'm at your feet. I'll play with you and then I'll bite you when I'm bored. <laughs> oh. <sighs> Stand up. Let's go spend your money. <laughs> Stop, darling. Wait for me. <laughs> <laughs> Oh no, the garlic didn't work. Maybe something here will work? Which one will hit her in the forehead? <laughs> Try both. What are you going to do with this bow and arrow? <laughs> it's harmless. I don't know, I didn't figure it out yet. Oh, and then I'll open all the curtains in the home and wait for the sun to come out. Then she'll dance for me. That's right. And you should attach silver coins to the arrows. Imagine how that will get to her. Yeah, that's right. Thanks, Chris. You're the best. Will you stay with me while I'm catching her? Of course. I won't leave you alone with her again. By the way, where's your medallion? Does it still work? Yes, it works well. Eva wasn't able to hypnotize me. And it didn't wear off at all? No. Why are you asking? What? I'm afraid for you. I don't want this horrible vampire to hypnotize you. I love you. Chris, you're so careful with me. I'm so lucky to have you. We'll take this. And this. And this. And this too. Yes, darling. We'll take whatever you want. You'll pay for all of this? Do you have any money? Hey, you're talking to a customer. Of course we have money. Dylan, pay. Just a second, darling. Now, I'll pay for everything. Uh. That's not enough. We need twice that. Give more money. What's wrong with you? I don't have any more money. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, darling. I let you down. <laughs> Stop crying. Then take all this back. No money, no good. Uh, just a second. This is all mine. Horrible thieves. They lost all fear. <sighs> You're driving me crazy. Do you know what I do to people who drive me crazy? <laughs> so what? Surprise me. <sighs> You're so mischievous. Let's go, Dylan. I want to try this all on. Uh-huh. Uh. Mom, Dad, how are you? We are fine. Yes, everything's great. Oh no, they're hypnotized. We need to talk to Eva. Eva is a wonderful daughter. She's the best. There's no one better than her. Yes, 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 I know. How can I bring you to your senses? Oh, maybe a loud noise? Ah, can you hear me? Ah! Why are you screaming? Stop it. Oh, you're already better. Okay, I'll explain quickly. Eva's a vampire and we need to get rid of her. I found a fang in the bathroom. And she has red eyes. Here's a photo. Oh no, she didn't show up in the photo, I'm so stupid! Well, let's throw her out right away! Casey, here you are! Chris, what have you done? I just managed to bring them to their senses and you scared them off and they're hypnotized again! Sorry, I didn't mean to, I didn't know! What happened, Chris? I need to go set a trap for Eva, not much time! We need to save your family! You're right, or my parents will never wake up! Let's go, Chris. I love controlling people. <laughs> ah, this loser Dylan will do anything for me. <laughs> that Casey ruined my birthday. 
<laughs> Who cares? I got tons of presents. <laughs> Beautiful. Now I'll be the most fashionable vampire in town. But the best present is this whole family. And Dylan. Hmm, I'll leave him for dessert. <laughs> I'll eat him last. <laughs> I'm coming, darling. I'll bring you the best presents. Stop! Don't move! Eva, you're my queen. I said stop! Hands up! Ow! Why are you so clumsy? Eva, I love Eva. I really love Eva! <gasps> what, Eva? Give me what you stole from the store. You don't know Eva? She's the most beautiful girl in the world. She and I are soulmates. We both love tomato juice. What are you talking about? Give me the boxes. And <laughs> she can read Ow! that. What are you doing? Ow. Oh, Eva's waiting for me. Sorry, I need to see my beloved. Oh, these teenagers. They go crazy with love. Mm -hmm. I love a blood cocktail. <laughs> mm. Oh, now my prey is here. <laughs> Finally, I'll have a real holiday. I'll nibble on this whole family. <laughs> Hello. You're probably Eva's parents. The parents of my beautiful, wonderful girlfriend. <sighs> yes, we are Eva's parents. She is the best daughter in the world. Uh, uh, what are you doing? We're sitting here and drinking tea. And we are talking about what a wonderful daughter we have in Eva. Such lovely tea. Hmm. Eva is a wonder. She's so clever. And sharp-toothed. <sighs> ah. Let's sit here all night and talk about how amazing she is. Yes, let's do it. Let's talk about this all night. Or all week. Yes, 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 yes. 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 Let's, Let's do, do it. it. Let's do it. Where is Chris off to? Everything's ready. It's time to stop Eva. Oh no, did he turn off his phone? Well, I'll show him. Oh no, he isn't even seeing my messages. Now he's sleeping. Since he chose sleep over me, I'll catch Eva myself. I don't have time to wait for him. <laughs> and she arranges her hair so prettily. And imagine, she likes juice. Just like me. <laughs> Tomato juice. <sighs> <sighs> well, my little snacks, now I'll feast on you. Eva, we were just talking about you. Sweetheart, we love you so much. You seem so happy. I want to see horror on your faces when I bite you. Hmm. Here you go. Oh! 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 Why are they here? <laughs> That's it. Now I'm having a real oh! celebration. Oh! Oh! What's this now? Eva. Eva! Who kept me from my dinner? This Casey again? I'll teach her a lesson! <sighs> Who's making noise and ruining my party? <gasps> mm, another treat. Did someone else decide to cheer me up? Huh. Now she'll come closer and I'll throw garlic at her. <laughs> It smells so good. Ah! Ah, garlic! Garlic! Ah! Caught 
you. Now you can't leave me. Oh no, what do I do? That's it, you have nowhere to run. Where's Chris? Hey, Chris, help me! Hi, pretty girls. What are you doing? What? <sighs> Eva, you're my queen! Oh! <sighs> Ow! It hurts! Where am I? Who are these people? Ah! What's going on? Someone's yelling! I need to go check! Chris, explain what's going on! Can't you see? Eva and I tricked you! <laughs> Wow, my boyfriend is a vampire? It couldn't be worse. This will ruin my reputation as a hunter. <laughs> what kind of hunter are you, loser? <laughs> <laughs> Back off. Now explain. Why did you pretend to be my boyfriend and you helped me catch Eva? You thought of plans. Keep your enemies close. And Eva isn't stupid. So I recommended nonsense to you so that Eva didn't have to worry. Yes, and me and Chris love each other. And he was just waiting for me to come back to town and get him. Ugh! What do you mean you love her? Wow, my boyfriend isn't just a vampire, he's also a traitor! Everything's over. Now we'll hypnotize you and bite your whole family. I wonder how? <laughs> Didn't expect that. <laughs> What's going on here? What? Is, how did you run away? Now obey me! No, Eva, that won't work. Oh gosh, I'm sick of you. So let's go, Chris. She won't let us be. We'll be back. Don't be on your guard. <laughs> <laughs> What's going on? Where's Eva? Is everything okay? Hello, I'm Casey's mom, Christy. Hey, it'll take too long to explain. Eva's a vampire, I'm a vampire hunter. Is this a game? What's going on here? I'll tell you later, it's a very long story. These children are driving us crazy. Let's go, Nate, I have a headache. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you for saving me, you're so brave. No, don't be silly, this is for you. Thank you. Oh. I'm glad that your parents listened to us and believed us. I probably wouldn't have believed it if I hadn't seen it. Yeah, when mom saw Eva's fang, she thought I was joking. And then she saw the coffin in her room and almost fainted. <laughs> <laughs> Our city is in danger. The vampires are still on the loose. We need to stop them. Yes, Dylan, don't worry. I'll work it out myself. I'll help you, Cassie. I'll become a hunter too. Dylan, thank you. But after this betrayal, I want to hunt alone. I like you, Casey. I want to be with you and catch vampires. Dylan, don't! Chris betrayed me, and you'll betray me. I can't believe anyone. Sorry. <laughs> What's wrong? Nothing's wrong. It just seemed like it. We'd better go to school. Let's go. Are you serious right now? You thought you saw your ex while kissing Chris? Yes, I don't understand what happened to me. <gasps> Casey, what is it? Just don't tell me that's him. There she is. <gasps> Cassie! Hi. I'm so glad to see you. Um... What are you doing here? Well, I decided to move to this town. <laughs> so now we'll be going to the same school. Aren't you glad? Yes, very glad. Uh, this is for you, by the way. 
I still need to take all my documents into the principal. See you around. <laughs> No way. Not one word. Who was that? He had a strange smell. I don't like him. That's a new student and Casey's ex. Eva, come on. Uh, oops, sorry. Her ex? Oh, but what's that smell? Why do you have this garbage? Well, Dylan gave it to me. You mean your ex? I'll have a few words with him. Well, something's going to happen. Casey, what does all this mean? It's not my fault that he transferred to our school. I didn't invite him. But it's obvious he didn't just show up here like that. Don't hiss at me. Get rid of this smelly garbage. Ugh! Garlic! Have you lost your minds, idiot? So he also gave you some garlic. Who even gives a bouquet of garlic as a present? So you're fighting. Very well, keep going. I like it. He just likes to give original gifts, and anyways, it's not like I went on a date with him. Why are you getting upset? Just because. Stop it. Calm down. Dylan came here, and who cares? I only love you. And I love you. I'm sorry for losing my temper. You didn't do anything wrong. By the way, I almost forgot. Here. A normal bouquet. Thank you, darling. They made up. But I do think this new kid Dylan will help me break them up. <laughs> this is the best book I've ever read. Did you stick a photo of Chris on your book? No, this is a book about Chris's family. Their whole history is in it. Ugh, why is she so obsessed with this vampire? <sighs> Since the garlic didn't work, I guess I'll have to find a new way to ruin this monster's life. Oh, you have such an interesting life. Only thing missing is a werewolf. That's right. <laughs> <laughs> What's that, a werewolf? Let's find out. Eva, don't! <gasps> a, dog! a dog! What a sweet little puppy! Well, he really doesn't look exactly like a werewolf. <laughs> oh, look! There's a note and some kind of bottle. For Cassie. What's in it? It looks like perfume. Hmm, lovely smell. Indeed, I expect Chris sent me a present. Amazing, a dog and perfume. What should we call the dog, by the way? Where is he going? Doggy, stop! Where's the dog? Uh, over there! Catch him! C Cassie, I was just coming to see you. I wasn't coming to you. We need to catch the dog. Where's that puppy? He ran away. Cassie, wait, I need to talk to you. I can't. Me and Eva are busy. We aren't busy at all. Eva. Ah, uh, well, you guys talk and I'll go. Oh no, the full moon. <laughs> oh. uh, now I really have to go. What was that just now? I was just kidding. It really doesn't matter. The important thing is that I want to apologize to I don't you. need your apologies. Bye. Wait. Please hear me out. I don't want to hear you or see you. You dumped me. I went to another city to be far away from you. Why did you show up here? Cassie. I had a serious reason for breaking up with you. It was difficult for me too. Huh? What was that? Lightning, probably. Just leave me alone already. I don't want to know anything about you. But you will be mine. I got a photo of them. A photo. Give it here. That's a ticket. Why did you want to make Chris and Casey fight? But they're such a cute couple. Don't make me mad. You never saw me, and I never asked you to do anything. Yes. Awesome. <gasps> What am I doing here? 
I don't even live in the area. Human food is not for me. All right, you can drink your blood juice in front of me. Awesome, you're the best. Bon appetit. Ooh, thanks. Who are you not wanting to answer over there? It's an unknown number. Uh, Casey, I've been looking for you everywhere. And I'm not the only one. Can I borrow Casey from you for a minute? Only if it's a short minute. Uh-huh. But who's looking for me? But Dylan. He looked everywhere and couldn't find you. I don't care. Eva, have you forgotten what I've told you? How much pain he caused me? I know. But if you don't go see him, he'll come here. Do you want Chris and Dylan to fight? Stupid Dylan. Fine, I'll meet him. Sorry, Chris, but Eva needs me right away. There's something very important that we have to do. All right, see you tonight. You know what you gotta do. Her again. The important thing is not to pay her any mind. Why aren't you saying hi? We don't usually talk. Come on, you're my favorite brother's girlfriend. Um, have a nice day. Am I seeing things or did Ariel just hug you? I'm shocked too. Hey, little brother, going already? And where's Cassie gone off to? I'm not about to discuss Casey with you. Go away. But I think we need to talk. I have very interesting information about your sweetheart. This again? I don't believe a single word you say. And what about this? What? Casey and that idiot? Yes, and now she's run off to meet him. Where? Where is she meeting him? We can find out. I put my earpiece into her purse. <laughs> Just don't break your phone. Wait up, Cassie. <gasps> what do you uh, want? You came. Less of that. Just tell me what you want right now, then I'm leaving. I understand that I hurt you, that you don't want to see me, etc., etc., but I can't stand aside while you're in danger. What danger is that? Don't you understand? Your boyfriend is a vampire. How did you know that? That doesn't matter. It doesn't matter how I found out. I'm worried about you, Cassie. Hey, get away from my girlfriend! Chris! Cassie, don't go near him! For years, his family has been luring in girls like you and then eating them. What are you talking about? Cassie, he doesn't love you. He's a liar. I said get away from her! Ah! Uh, silver is dangerous for vampires. <laughs> but how do you know so much about us? Haven't you guessed yet? You're a werewolf. Seriously? A werewolf? Dylan, why didn't you say so? Stay away from him. From this moment on, you're not going to talk to this monster. Don't come near Casey. You're a monster like me. Casey, promise me. That hurts! Dylan's right, you're a monster just like him! And I'll decide who I talk to. <laughs> it looks like you just lost her. <laughs> not a chance. Fine, I'll let you live for now, and then I'll sort you out. <sighs> uh, how could she? Uh! Hey, hello, calm down. You're tearing the house apart. Mm -hmm. uh. I'll never cast you aside, ever. <laughs> It's all right. Calm down and take a deep breath. It'll help. Is that better? Yeah, thank you. Excellent. That little rat isn't worth getting upset over. You were right to break up with her. We didn't break up. It's just your ex-boyfriend, the werewolf, who wants to take my Casey from me. He's what? A werewolf? That idiot is talking with the vampire's worst enemy and you keep going out with her? Yes, I love her. But how would you know about that? 
You're a real piece of work. You're an idiot, Chris. An idiot! Can't you be any quieter? You disturbed our vampire dreams. Mom, Dad, did you know that our lovely, charming Cassie is friends with a werewolf? What? what? Chris, you know very well that any friends if werewolves are our and enemies. And your Casey is no exception. You need to break up with her. I'm so sick of you guys. <sighs> wow, it looks like you really made him mad. I'm actually mad myself, but now he'll notice me. Then I won't get in your way. What's that smell? Ah, my eyes are burning. Casey, what do you have on? Ah! The perfume you gave me. What perfume? This one. I never gave that to you. Have you decided to make fun of me now? That's verbena, right? Verbena? Doesn't that make you sick? Do you not understand? Why are you ruining my presents? You're already accepting presents from him? I didn't know they were his presents. I thought you had given them to me. I'm fed up with you, Dracula. Come at me. Enough! Stop it! Don't stop me from dealing with this dog. Would you stop it? Dylan hasn't done anything wrong. He's a werewolf. That tells you everything. At least I don't eat people. Okay, Casey. Go ahead and talk to him, but do it without me. Just go away. <laughs> I hate him. Are you planning on throwing anything else? <laughs> My poor Casey. He has no right to tell me what to do and who to talk to. Yeah, that's right. By the way, I know how to lift your spirits. You have a guest. If it's Chris, then I don't want to see him. No, come on in. Hello. Hello. Uh, I better get going. I brought your favorite strawberry cake. Wow, thank you. What are we going to do? I actually was hoping we could have a normal conversation. Now you know that I'm a werewolf and... Is that the reason we broke up? Yes, I wasn't ready for you to know about that yet. But then I found out that you were going out with that bloodsucker. Let's not talk about him. <sighs> As you like. So do you forgive me? Of course. <sighs> By the way, can you tell me how you became a werewolf? You turn into a big wolf, right? No, in town I turn into a dog. Because, well, people can get scared of a wolf, as you know. Yes, of course. So that means you turn into some kind of terrifying dog? Well, almost. Look. Into that dog? How do you like it? Well, it's very, very... <laughs> I'm sorry, I can't help myself. <laughs> I'm actually more threatening when I look like this. And this is less noticeable. All right, all right, I'm sorry. Listen, shall we go to the movies? I'd love to. <laughs> and where have you been? It doesn't matter. With your Cassie? And tell me, do you have anything between your ears? Yes, and that's why I want Casey back. I won't let you. She's friends with a werewolf. You're putting our whole family in danger again. You'd better go away, or else I'll make you. Okay, if you're so pig-headed, go. Just at least take this. It's a dog whistle. It'll help with that Dylan. Thank you. You're not so bad after all. You're an idiot, of course, but you're still my brother. Bye. Where is she? Who? Casey! I can't find her anywhere! 
Uh, she's at the movies with Dylan. <laughs> oh no, Casey will kill me. She asked me not to say anything to Chris. Although, it's even more dangerous not to say anything to Chris. Uh, whatever, they'll figure it out themselves. <laughs> <laughs> What's wrong? This is a very funny film. Look. <laughs> funny? It's a horror film. But look how they do the werewolves. <laughs> we don't act like that. <laughs> Where are they? <laughs> <laughs> Don't be scared. I'm here. How dare he touch my Casey? I'll teach him a lesson. <gasps> Dylan, is everything okay? Oh! <sighs> <laughs> what about now? <laughs> Dylan, you're scaring me. Oh! oh, 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 oh. Yes! Chris? What have you done with Dylan? You don't like it? In my opinion, he looks far better this way. <laughs> <laughs> Give that here. Why are you making fun of him? <sighs> How are you? Oh, my head is spinning. Stay away from that flea bag, Casey. I'm a flea bag. Aren't you? Or maybe you use some flea spray. Uh. Enough! I've had enough! Uh. Casey, wait! <sighs> Stop! Let me go! I'm sorry, but I simply can't see you with anyone but me. I'm losing my mind! It happens all the time. Why can't you just be friends with Dylan? Well, I'm sorry, but try to understand. Dylan is a werewolf, and vampires can't be friends with werewolves. Let me go already. Please stay away from Dylan or my family. What about your family? Against it again, they're always finding new reasons for you to break up with me. Casey. Don't touch me. I'm tired of this. I'm tired of the constant problems with you and your family. No, don't say that. We need to take a break. I need to decide if it's worth continuing this relationship or not. Casey. <sighs> What's with him? Darling? Is everything alright? Uh-huh. Did you decide to look at the predictions? Open it up. No, this is just the same envelope my Casey cut herself on. Not my Casey anymore. You can take one if you want. Really? Any letters okay? Whichever one you want. Did you cut yourself? Mm-hmm. Harry, I think things are really bad. Yes, I've never seen him like this. What happened? Did you break up with Casey? Almost. All because of our feud with Dylan. Listen, maybe Dylan isn't so bad as all that. That's right. He hasn't actually done anything wrong. <sighs> That's right. I don't mind if Casey's friends with that werewolf. Great. But I don't think it's going to help now. You know, honey, I think it's time to take matters into our own hands. I completely agree. Uh, hi, are you ready? Casey, hello. Huh? Why did you come so early? Early? It's already time for school. Come on. All right, okay, let's go. Okay, I see. Tell me, uh, do you know how to reconcile with Chris? I wish. With Dylan? I guess... I think... I've fallen in love with Dylan again, but I also love Chris! Oh, Casey, you're definitely surprising me! What do I do? What do I do? Okay, first of all, calm down. Breathe. <sighs> mm -hmm. Done. First off, you need to have a serious conversation with Chris. Yeah. Maybe you're right. Good girl, let's go, you can talk to him at school. Hey guys, who would you choose? A werewolf or a vampire? Tell me in the comments. <laughs> Ouch, Ariel, could you stop? Shut up. 
<laughs> These vampires drive me crazy. Uh, hi, everyone. Where's Chris? Is he not here yet? And he's not coming, thanks to you, sweetie. You drove off my brother. Meaning? Don't pretend to not understand. I won't let anyone hurt my family. <laughs> Don't you dare touch her. Ugh, go away, you smell like a dog. More vampires? They're vampires? <gasps> Hello, Hello, everyone. everyone. Hello. <sighs> what are you doing here? We came to talk to Casey. With me? Why? Circumstances are such that our son is suffering without you. And so we do not oppose your friendship with this. What? So, would you agree to come to dinner with us tonight? I, um... I agree. Perfect. Then we'll wait for you tonight at 6. Have you lost your minds again? Ariel, don't start. Don't even think about it. We'd better go, honey. Yes, just a moment. Ah! Wolfsbane! <laughs> Oops, that was a mistake. How do you like the pizza? Delicious, thanks! I'm glad you were hungry this time. At least our efforts were in vain. <laughs> <laughs> I'm so glad that you made up. I'm glad too. I hope that we aren't going to fight anymore. Oh, how sweet! I guess I'm hungry. Mmm. Fresh. Stop! You what? Not in front of Casey! Ah, I'm sorry. But your pistol was concealed from me. I should have known to be you. I don't think this is any better. Raw meat is better than my neck. <laughs> <laughs> bon appetit to me. Good evening, my dear and beloved family. I came to congratulate you on all being idiots. Ariel, get out of here. We don't need seeds right now. Yeah, you can say that. Do you think that Dylan is a werewolf who never did anything bad to us? He didn't do anything. You shut up. Ariel! Just wait, brother. We'll see if you protect her after this. What is this? A werewolf family tree? Yes. And it's the same family that has been following us for 20 centuries and stopping us from living normal lives. That's right. This one almost bit off my arm. And what's this? Dylan! What? You mean that Dylan's family is... Our chief enemy? Casey, you need to cut off all ties with that flea bag right away! Or you can forget about Chris! Mom! Stop! That's enough! I'm done with this for good! Sorry, Chris, but we're breaking up! Casey! Don't even think about it! Chris, go away! Casey, I'm begging you, don't leave me. I can't live without you. All you need to do is cut Dylan out of your life. Chris, I already told you that I'll decide who I make friends with. Casey. Didn't you understand? I told you to get out. No, you get out of here. Cassie will be mine. Casey is mine. Chris, don't. Casey, go away. Cassie. Oh no, forgive me. Please forgive me. I didn't mean to. Don't get near me ever. Go away before I make you leave. I'm leaving. Forgive me, Casey. Forgive me. <laughs> I did tell you that vampires were dangerous. I never want to see him again, ever. Then let's leave. Let's go back to our city. Yes, yes, I agree. And forget that nightmare vampire once and for all. It worked. <laughs> this is the best decision, believe me. You'll be much better off with me than with Chris. Right, without Chris. Ah! Ah! 
Oh, not that memory. What? What did you say? Nothing. Turn up for the night. Real thing, she's no average girl. Give us your bucks quickly. <laughs> I dare you, just touch her. Chris! Who the heck are you? We'll deal with you too. What the heck? <laughs> what the heck? Let's get out of here. Uh, uh. OMG, how did you do this? They were just really slow. That's crazy. Hey! Don't touch me. Chris, what's going on? No, you shouldn't be talking to me. You don't have any idea who I am. No! Don't you- Stop, you dumb zombie! Sweetheart, I really hope you won't turn into a zombie! You can't escape from me! Where did you put the newborn baby? What newborn baby? I don't understand what you're talking about! Uh, There's no baby here! We don't have much time! We gotta catch all the infected! Uh, but I saw a child! Where is she? A child? What a cutie! Who love you here? <coughs> Dina! I hope you won't mind if I decide to adopt you! Alright, today we are taking a test. Here you go. Oh, I see we have a newcomer in our class. Right on time. We have a pop quiz today. I don't understand anything here. How do I solve this? Seems like I know. <laughs> Look what she just came up with! Pranking the teacher! <laughs> <laughs> what silly jokes! Oh, how disgusting! <laughs> Gross! <gasps> My eye! I found it! <sighs> One more stunt like that and you'll get a reprimand! <laughs> That's cool what you did! Look, I can do magic tricks too! Look, here's my finger! <laughs> and now it's gone! <laughs> <laughs> That's easy to replicate. Here. Oh, uh oh. Oh! Uh, ew! That's gross! How did she do that? So she didn't actually rip her finger off? Um, it's not real. <laughs> She's so weird. Let's go, Zara. Uh, something seems off to me, I guess. Oh, sweetheart, how was your first day at school? I got an A. <sighs> I don't want to worry mom with silly stuff. I'm glad my worries didn't come true. Then I'll go prepare some treats for my new friends for tomorrow. Huh. What pleasant news! My daughter has already found herself some friends! Oh, hello, yes? Miss Honey, of course! I'll come to the school if needed! She must want to praise Dina! <laughs> Girls, these are for you. Please have some. Why not? It's really delicious. Uh, I'd rather have a banana. <laughs> ah, she's crazy! Let's get out of here! Ah! Ah! Watch out! Why are you running away? <gasps> Mommy, 
What are you doing here? Your teacher called me. Dina, I need to talk to your mom privately. All right. I have to eavesdrop on what they're going to talk about. Oh, love, Dina needs to see a doctor. She's seriously behind for her age. What the heck? I can't hear a thing. <sighs> Much better. Look at her test. Even a first grader can answer these questions. I don't know what to do with her. Dina is adopted. I found her in the bushes and she's been developmentally behind since birth. What? My mom isn't my real mom? This can't be. But despite everything, I love Dina. Maybe there's a way to help her somehow? <sighs> <laughs> hey, be careful. Where are you rushing? I'm sorry. <laughs> what happened? Lab isn't my real mother. I have to find my true mother. Finding a person isn't that hard? Why are you crying? But I have no idea where to start looking. <laughs> Poor thing. I can help you with that. My mother works at the city archives. What's that got to do with it? They've got all the info on people there. I can sneak you in and maybe we'll find something. Seriously? Thank you. Just be quiet. If my mom finds out we're snooping around here, we're done for. Uh, nothing. There's nothing in this one either. Oh, a missing child announcement. Looking for a child abandoned in the bushes. Mother of the year, leave a child in the bushes. My mother found me right there! Now I'll get back at you for your pranks. Mm, but where do I find her? Summer, where are you? Someone's coming. I gotta hide. Mom, I really saw a girl sneaking into the archives. And where is she now? Vanished? Actually, I don't know. She was here. Ah! Well, I'll sort this girl out. Come out, little thief. There was a noise. They came from here. <laughs> <laughs> Wasn't that a fun prank? Get out of here. My mom will wake up and I'll get in trouble because of you. But you're the one who ratted me out to your mother. You only play dumb when it suits you. You're so mean. <laughs> These kids are seriously driving me nuts. What happened? There's this weird girl in my class. And today, can you believe it? She cracked a joke about her eye falling out. Are you sure it was a joke? Could she be some kind of zombie? Where would that come from? You cut all the zombies 16 years ago and isolated them from people. Mm, well, I remember that day. That's when Brittany's child went missing. <sighs> Eric, look at all these people! Oh no, what have I done? They could all get infected! We've got to warn them. Don't do it. They'll arrest me. I'll fix this. I'll cure them all. But there's a lady with a baby right there. It's too late now. <sighs> What's happening to me? What's gonna happen to them now? Catch them. We need to isolate everyone. Come with us. We'll help you. Ah! Stop. Where are you going? 
Brittany told us she left a baby in the bushes, but we never found it. So it means Dina is Brittany's child? <gasps> yes, and most likely she's a zombie. This is all your fault and your experiments! I only wanted to prevent humanity from viral diseases! You're acting like a madman, even now, always cooped up in your lab! Because I have to make it right, I'll find the cure! <sighs> it's time for you to stop! How many failed experiments on zombies have you conducted? Less complaining, and better help me find the girl! <sighs> we should visit her at her home! Let's go! <laughs> <laughs> what are you doing here, homeless girl? Get up and get out of my father's farm! <laughs> I have nowhere to go! <laughs> What's that got to do with me? My mother isn't my real mother! And she doesn't love me! <laughs> uh, so why are you wetting the hay bales with tears, then? If you want, stay on the farm. Really? Yes, but you'll have to help me with the farm work. All right, thank you. I agree. All right, then. Grab some straw. Oh. Please come in. Uh, Miss Honey, did Dina get into some trouble again? <laughs> no, I just brought her to see a good doctor. Please call her. But Dina isn't back home yet. I thought she was at school. I'll call her right away. When Dina comes home, give Honey a call. I'm a, d a doctor and can treat her. <laughs> My daughter might be a bit dummy, but I'm not sure Dina is sick. <sighs> a checkup won't hurt. <laughs> we need to find Dina urgently because if she's truly a zombie, she could infect everyone. <gasps> I must be a terrible mom for not noticing when Dina disappeared. Working on a farm is really tough. You're just carrying a small pumpkin. Here, let me help you with that. <laughs> it's not heavy at all. Oh no, my hand. Oh no, it's awkward how kind you are to me. Let me do it myself. It's really no problem. But still. Uh, <laughs> okay, okay, fine. fine. Ouch! You almost crushed my foot. Oh, I'm sorry. I didn't mean to. <sighs> I know you did it on purpose to show me what an extraordinary girl you are. Well, I just... <laughs> <sighs> How about we go on a date together? I'm not against it. Uh, I gotta find my sweetie! Do we have a new teacher? Who is this? Girls, have you seen Dina? <laughs> we don't hang out with that wild girl! She's totally nuts! <laughs> and who are you anyway? I'm Dina's mother, and no one should dare insult my daughter! Are you her real mother or not? Because Dina was actually looking for a real mother! What? So Dina found out that I adopted her? Is that why she took off? Let's go, Zara! It seems her whole family is a bit crazy! Mav, what are you doing here? Did you find Dina? No, unfortunately, Dina is searching for a real mother. Don't be upset. You should head back home, and if I get any leads, I'll let you know right away. Okay. How are you feeling about this summer food? Probably good. I've never eaten anything like this before. <laughs> are you kidding? Then what do you like to eat? Uh, you're about to find out. It's not Halloween yet. You gotta try this first. Mmm, it's delicious. Oh, maybe you'll try corn, too. <laughs> what? I didn't catch that. Did you swallow your tongue? <laughs> no. How did you guess? Uh, Want to try my food instead? Dina, 
I think I like you. Uh, what are you doing? <laughs> just trying to taste you. Ah! <laughs> ah! I was just kidding! Oh, my bad. I got carried away. Oh, let me treat your hand. All right, just sit back. <laughs> That's my payback! <laughs> what? Your leg really fell off? How is that possible? <laughs> no, Justin, hold on! Oh, I think I scared him off. No one will ever love me now. <laughs> I don't understand what's happening to me. Uh, uh, be careful! Uh, 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 oh, where did the zombie come from? Zombie? What are you talking about? Uh, where's my eye? Uh, uh, it must be Tina who infected him. This is exactly what I feared. We need to find the poor eye. Uh, hurry up! What are you doing over there? And better yet, help lift him! We need to take him to the other zombies! Uh, oh, uh, I found it! Uh, that's better! You've become strangely fond of these creatures! How dare you say that! Can't you see he's just a child? Just a regular zombie! Uh, uh. I have to find my mother and ask about my weirdness! I should go to the police. We need to close it quickly before the zombies notice us. Where am I? My eye! It's still there. Let us out of here! What else? You won't go anywhere until I cure you! Hello, beautiful. Who is this grumpy snake to you? <laughs> <laughs> He's my husband. You deserve better. I'm ready to give you my hand and heart. Really. <laughs> Just not the heart, please. Honey, watch this pleasant conversation there. Let's go, we need to find Dina. You go search for her. I'm going to the police. Let the professionals handle this. Uh. Sky, we really need to keep counting to keep our brains from drying up. Uh, so now I'm a zombie? Uh. <gasps> hey, where did you get that handkerchief? <gasps> I saved a girl, and she bit me in gratitude. <gasps> so my daughter is alive! But she's a zombie. I couldn't protect her from getting infected. So you're Tina's mother, and she was looking for you. We might never be found by anyone. Uh, why do you say that? <laughs> we will figure something out. Because there used to be a lot of zombies here, and then Eric started taking them away, and they disappeared. Sky, get my mind off things. Let's go count forks! <laughs> oh, girls, hello. Can I join your game? Seriously? Daydream again? Go where you're going. <gasps> right, I was going to the police. Summer, what's gotten into you? Let's have some fun! Dina, hold on! Summer's just joking! Pass the ball! Huh? What the heck? Ah, it's real! Ah, Girls, ah, give it back! Ah, turns out Dean is a zombie! Who's a zombie? Ah, let's get out of here! My hand! Give it back, you scoundrels! Oh, what should I do? Oh no, Miss Honey! She must not notice that I'm missing a hand! Oh! Oh! This is such a stroke of luck! Dina, where did you go? Your mother is looking for you! 
I overheard your conversation, and I know she's not my real mother. Uh, do you want me to introduce you to your real mother? Really? That would be amazing. <laughs> Dina, there's your mother. <gasps> Mommy! That was easy. You fell for it. But for some reason, I feel sorry for her. <sighs> Mommy! What did you call me? Are you Dina, my little girl? Yes! <gasps> so I'm not the only one? I really am a zombie? Unfortunately, yes! Honey, did you come back for my heart? <laughs> you're so funny. Too bad you're a zombie. What's wrong with you? Why are you keeping us here? <sighs> Eric is afraid the infection will spread. So he isolated you here. But Eric takes the zombies away and they disappear. Why? Eric wants to cure the zombies, but it seems like he's gone crazy. Honey... Please let us out. You see, we won't harm anyone. Well, I don't know. Eric is my husband. I should trust him. Miss Honey, please. I want to go to school like regular kids. <laughs> All right, fine. What have you decided, traitor? <sighs> Come with me. <sighs> Why are you standing there? Eric, please let him go! I need to test my new treatment! Let me in! Don't touch Drake! Uh, you scoundrel, Eric! Better stay away! This time, everything will work perfectly! You've got to witness my triumph! <laughs> no! You turned Drake into zombie powder! I hate you, uh, Eric! Uh, this can't be! Uh, but I have to fix this! The formula is almost there! Science isn't your thing! When will you understand that? I need another zombie! Drake, forgive me! I won't let Eric experiment with zombies anymore! <laughs> Din, I'm sorry I turned you into a zombie. I had no idea it would turn out like this. What's the use of being mad now? We need to figure out how to get out of here. Maybe this can help. Uh, I doubt we'll get out of here. Ah, step away from the bars! You've already annoyed me enough! <laughs> Brittany, you'll come with me for the experiment. <laughs> of course! <laughs> That's good, obedient zombie. Come on. Mom, no! Eric, let her go! You scoundrel! We have to save Brittany or she'll disappear like all the other zombies. But how are we going to do that? <laughs> Where's Brittany? Eric took her! How can I miss it? Eric has completely lost it. You have to stop him. Dina, we will follow Eric's trail. And Sky will hide on my farm. Come on, move faster. There they are. We need to hide so Eric doesn't notice us. Uh, I'll detach my own arm and grab Eric by the leg. That's genius! Uh, uh. Ah! Uh. Uh, how did I end up here? Mommy! Come over here and grab Justin's hand! Uh, uh. Huh? Uh. Uh. <gasps> uh. 
curses! How could I trip on flat ground? Uh, oh, where are the zombies? Uh, 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 I'll have to go find new ones! <gasps> Eric! Uh, and you're looking at me as if I've done something terrible! That's because I did! I released all the zombies! Uh, why? Why would you do that? Because you've gone mad because of them and forgot about me! I'm done with this! I'm leaving you! Fine, go! I only need the zombies, and I know where to find them. <laughs> We're gonna have a zombie farm with zombie cabbage now. It seems like someone just wants to slack off from work. <sighs> this one-handed situation is so inconvenient. Let's all go inside and have some food instead. Finally, I'm starving. Dina, why are you just standing here? You all go ahead and I'll catch up with you. Uh -huh. It's nice to be with those who understand me. <laughs> Summer, that's Dina. Yes, we need to pass unnoticed. Ladies, hey there. <laughs> She's a monster. <laughs> Stop! <gasps> give me my hand back! No! Well, give it to Miss Honey! Let everyone know that you're a zombie! <laughs> you make me laugh. The teacher already knows everything. <gasps> <gasps> Zara, just grew that letter happened! <gasps> <laughs> Silly girls, you'll learn not to insult me! Dina! Are you coming soon? I'm coming, Mommy! But what about my friend, Lav? I miss her. I should pay her a visit! Eric, what's happening? Why are you here? Dina's not home. I know. <laughs> uh, let me go, you maniac! <laughs> Sorry, but all the zombies ran away from me. And I've got experiments to carry out. What are you talking about? What zombies and what does this have to do with me? <laughs> I'm going to turn you into a zombie. And then, and then I'll cure you. No, don't touch my mom. Ah, ah, what have you done? I'll turn your mom into a zombie. No, please don't. I'm a zombie. Take me for your experiments instead. My daughter, I couldn't protect you who did this to you mom it's not your fault i've always been a zombie i just didn't know it my child you should know that i love you and always felt you were special mommy i love you too oh how touching but it's time for us to leave mom everything will be okay <laughs> i must say my sweet girl Curse you, Dina! You turned me into a zombie! Eric, now you're one of us. Isn't it time to stop the experiments? No! I must cure everyone! And you better sit quietly, or I'll come back for your mother! <sighs> What's this flower? <laughs> this is my brilliant invention, the zombie flower. It makes all zombies sleep. <laughs> I think I've seen it somewhere before. Guys, check the comments for which video you saw this flower in. There's a strange smell. <laughs> Where's Tina? Oh. She decided to take a nap. Hmm. What was I going to do? Oh, oh, um, uh, ah, right, I need to find zombies. My dear daughter, what have you done? I won't leave you here. <laughs> I got it. I couldn't protect her! <laughs> I just made a new friend! 
so many zombies here. I'll cure all of you. <laughs> oh, I can't believe it. Dennis a zombie. I refuse to dig a grave for her. Ugh. We must convince Justin. Come back. It's so hard to run when you're a zombie. Oops! Why is it so dark in here? Thank you. It smells great. Hello, everyone. I'm Dina, and I wanted to say you won't be seeing me for a while. I'd like to say goodbye to all of you. Thank you all for the wonderful times. I love you all. Goodbye, everyone. Ah! <laughs> Maybe that's enough experiments? No. I have to cure everyone. <laughs> all right, all right. 